Question 3 in the book of Al-Mutashabihat, the allegories. A. It is known that Iblis was banned from heaven because of his refusal to prostrate to Adam, peace be upon him. So how was he able to enter heaven and whisper to Adam and make him eat of the forbidden tree? The words of Iblis to Adam indicate that he was with him in heaven because he pointed to the tree using the pronoun this, which indicates he was not far from it. B. What is the tree that Adam, peace be upon him, ate from? C. Was the nakedness of Adam and Eve showing without clothing and then when they ate from the tree they became aware of their nakedness so they covered themselves with the leaves of heaven? And what are the leaves they covered themselves with? The answer of Imam Ahmad al-Hasan al-Yamani alayhi salam To answer these questions an introduction is needed which is Verily Adam peace be upon him was created from mud meaning from this earth. However, he did not remain only on this earth, rather he ascended to the highest point of the low sky, i.e. he ascended to the first sky, or say the door to the second sky, and it is the kingdom of heaven, or as described in the narration of Ahlul Bayt, peace be upon them. He was placed in the door of heaven, i.e. the kingdom of heaven, trod on by the angels. And this ascension of Adam's mud requires that his mud shines by the light of its Lord, and that it be pleasant. Thus, when Allah transmitted the soul into Adam for the first time, his body was pleasant, enjoying the materialistic physical heaven, and there was no darkness in this heaven which would require the emission of impurities from the body of Adam, peace be upon him. As for Adam's soul, peace be upon him, it was enjoying the kingdom of heaven, or the kingdoms of heaven, because there are many gardens beneath which rivers flow. Chapter 2, verse 25 And the physical heaven and kingdom of heaven are the two mentioned in Surah Ar-Rahman, but the one who fears the rank of his Lord shall have two gardens of spreading branches. Chapter 55, verse 46 to 48 and they are also, and besides these two gardens, another two, both dark green. Chapter 55, verse 62 to 64. And the ascension is an ascension of manifestation, appearance, and not an ascension of location. Thus, Adam was not non-existent in the physical earth which we live in. Rather, he existed in it, and if he were non-existent in it, the physical earth, he would have been dead. Hence, Adam, peace be upon him, lived in this world with a pleasant body in the beginning, but he then returned dense to the earth from which he had ascended when he disobeyed his Lord, subhanahu wa ta'ala. B. The tree that Adam, peace be upon him, ate from was wheat, apple, date, fig, etc. And it is the tree of the knowledge of the progeny of Muhammad, peace be upon them. Thus, these fruits in the higher worlds symbolize knowledge. And this blessed tree mentioned in the Quran carried the knowledge particular to Muhammad and the family of Muhammad, peace be upon them. See, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, but the best of all is the garment of piety. The garment that was ripped from Adam and Eve was the garment of piety. So in the higher worlds in which they used to live, nakedness is covered by piety. This is because piety becomes a garment which covers the body of the human in those worlds. So when Adam, peace be upon him, and Eve, peace be upon her, disobeyed by eating from the blessed tree, the tree of knowledge of the family of Muhammad, peace be upon him, that becomes an indignation for whoever eats from it without permission of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He lost the garment of piety, and so their nakedness became apparent to them. As for the leaves of heaven with which they cover themselves, they are the religion, where the green leaves in the higher worlds represent religion, and those leaves which Adam peace be upon him and Eve peace be upon her covered with were repentance and asking forgiveness from Allah by the right of the people of the cloak peace be upon them 
whose names were read by Adam, peace be upon him, as written on the leg of the throne. A. The heaven which Iblis, Allah curse him, was banned from was the kingdom of heaven and also heaven of this world. However, Adam, peace be upon him, existed in all the earthly worlds. Therefore, the whispers of Iblis, Allah curse him, were towards the Adam who was present in the earthly worlds which are beneath the heaven of this world. As for his pointing towards the tree as if it was in his presence, Allah curse him, it is because the fruits of the trees on this earth are but an appearance and manifestation of the knowledge of the family of Muhammad, peace be upon them. So the apple, the wheat, and the fig, etc., are the blessings of the knowledge of the family of Muhammad, peace be upon them. As mentioned in the dua, in the narrations from them, peace be upon them, by them you are given sustenance.